Greetings and welcome. My name is Benevolent Bodhi. This is Welcome to Tamriel. In this video, we're going to look at the antiquity system of the Elder Scrolls Online and how to simplify excavation. The antiquity system is a collection of two mini-games introduced to the Elder Scrolls Online with the Greymore chapter. These two mini-games are Scrying and Excavation. Excavation is the process to dig up prized historical artifacts. There are two types of tools. There is a sensing tool and digging tools. The auger is like ground penetrating radar which can detect objects and how far away they are in the dirt. Several players find the dig area a bit intimidating. Often players will randomly move about the dig site and hope for the best. The color of the auger test results indicate how far away the main relic is located. At this point you might be thinking for someone that is trying to make an instruction video on finding antiquities, so far the search for finding the relic couldn't be any worse. Or is it? This example shows you. One, no matter how badly your excavation is going, if you have the points, you can recover. Two, you can mostly ignore the color of each auger test. I'll give you some time to process that. Ignore the color. Watch what happens next. On the very next test, we find the relic. I wouldn't blame you for thinking that that was just pure dumb luck. Let's take a look at the clip again. This time we'll ignore the color of the auger test zones and focus on the zones highlighted in white. These white zones are the key to having great success in finding the relics. Note the area by the test site is not highlighted in white. Note the area around the new test site is not white, so it's not there either. The relic's not here either. All of the white zones overlapped in this corner, therefore the relic must be there. Let's look at a typical excavation. In this test case, we were within the white zone. Next, we focus our search within the white zone. In summary, when excavating, focus your attention on the white areas revealed when the cursor is hovered over a tested area. Systematically move around the dig site and test areas to eliminate areas to search. The relic will be found in the area where the white zones of the tested areas overlap. And there you have it, excavation simplified. Thanks for watching. Didn't take notes? You can get them at my website at benevolentbony.ca. Did you like the video? Please smash the subscribe and like buttons. Have a question or suggestion? Please leave a comment below. Until next time, take care everybody.